Hi everyone and welcome to my HPR free tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to manage SH probes and how to use them. SH probe is a small tool for the box light that helps us to use baked lighting on dynamic objects and static objects. We can use light probes to sample the nice baked lighting at various points in the scene. We can then interpret the nearby probes to guess what will the lighting be at the current location of an object and use the results to light the object. In short, SH probes can help us to store incoming light data from an object and then use the light in our scene. In the long run, it doesn't really differ from a regular box light lightning, but sometimes you can definitely see better results. So, this is an example room I made. Um, this room doesn't have any box lights, so we're gonna add one. This box light is gonna be the global box light for the room. Okay, let's call it. All right. So, what we're gonna do now is go to Edit, Manage SH, and as you can see, we can add sets. There is a default set, but we're going to create a new one. We call it SH Global. Okay. Okay, I recommend to use production quality and bounce number, which is the number of bounces the probes will do. About 10. We're going to select the SH probe we just created and add it. So after a short rendering time, and we get this. Now it's a, it's a little too bright, so we're going to decrease it to something about 0 0.03. Yeah, I think that's fine. So, um, I think we can add another one to this um, desk area. So we can keep um, more accurate lighting at this area. That should do it. Box light desk. Okay. Let's create another SH object. Now we shall add it to the box light. That looks pretty decent. So this is, this is how it looks with an SH probe. And this is how it looks without an SH probe. You can definitely see a difference. I think it looks pretty good. Um, let's see how the room looks without an SH probe but with a normal box light lighting. New box light. Uh, we don't have an SH probe, so we need to choose our color manually. Something like that, I think. Maybe even, maybe brighter. Mm. Yeah, okay. That's it. That's how the room looks without an SH probe. Um, in this case, it looks pretty much the same, but there are many cases you can use an SH probes to achieve um, better lightning. So that's about it for this tutorial. Um, I will include this map in the description without this box site, so you can play around with it by yourself. And uh, yeah, that's all.